Kisumu as well as to Eldoret, Malindi and Ukunda. And the National Environmental Management Authority, NEMA, has intensified its enforcement of the plastic ban just days into the new year. The authority recently seized a consignment of 14 bales of banned plastic bags and carrier bags from two local traders. Here's more. So yes, Mr. Martin. It was the end of underground profiting and the beginning of legal proceedings against these two traders from Kajiado County after they were found in possession of several bales of the banned plastic bags. This operation has just begun for this, this year and it's going to be rolled out in all the counties. Uh, the similar exercise is taking place in all the 47 counties. So we are calling upon the public to embrace uh, the law and to start using alternatives. The traders, who seemed somewhat unfazed by our presence, were at pains to explain to Ms. Janet Arangu, the chief inspector of NEMA police, why they had the bags knowing very well that they were banned in Kenya since August the 28th of 2017. My, all, all these consignment, huh? mm -hmm. they, they, they are not carry bags. Uh, they, uh, they are bags which are just plain. Meant for packing, flat bags. Flat, flat bags, meant for Packaging of clothes, packaging of phone stuff. But I think you are aware in Kenya they have been abolished. Why do you bring them from Uganda and yet you know very well they have been abolished in Kenya? It appears some traders have deployed ways and techniques that were able to go under the radar from as far as from neighboring countries. To this, Ali Mwanze, the deputy director of field operations, NEMA, said that there were no techniques that could stop them from enforcing the ban, adding that they too learned these techniques before they could become strongly established. People are using different methods uh, to be able to cheat the authorities that are in charge of uh, enforcing the ban. And uh, many people are disguising, uh, like uh, carrying them in ba travel bags, uh, in buses, and they are, therefore... Uh, they are able to escape the enforcement officers. But, but uh, we are vigilant enough. We've learned the tricks people are using, and we are down on the ground, and we have a network of informers, and we are following these leads and making arrests. Several small traders around the country risk imprisonment of up to four years or a fine of between two million to four million shillings. Traders try to maximize revenue by relying on the cheap imports of banned plastic bags. But NEMA says it will not relent in their efforts of enforcing the ban, adding that it does not stop with the shop owners and manufacturers. Since the exercise started countrywide, um, we've arrested uh, a lot of people. And uh, the cases are continuing before court. And it is a reality that be people are being arrested um, when found using the flat bags, whether you are a small mamamboga in the market or a big manufacturer. Uh, and so far, we have over 50 cases that we have in our, in our records, and we want this particular list to grow, uh, to become very big, because now